This is a DVD of an old movie from 1973, uh, The Sting, uh, starring Robert Redford and Paul Newman. And it received uh, seven Oscars at that time. And well, in 1973, I was just nine years old, but uh, later in life, this movie kind of changed my life. So, the sting. In Swedish, where I'm from, I'm from Stockholm in Sweden, and uh, in Sweden this movie was called Blåsningen, <laughs> which is a, a the blow away or something like that. I found this in a gas station. <laughs> it was, uh, what could it be? Uh, 30 kronor, which is about three dollars or something like that. And uh, this is nice though, it's a nice concept for a movie. There are two conmen in the 1930s, Chicago. After a friend is killed by the mob, they try to get even by attempting to pull out the ultimate sting. No one is to be trusted as the twists unfold, leading up to the one of the greatest double crosses in movie history. The con is out. Yeah, <laughs> nice concept. Anyway, um, actually, I, I don't remember anything from this movie. Apart from one scene where Paul Newman, uh, he was, uh, they are going to play some poker and he is a cheat, he's a con man and he did some card slides. Let me just show you a little bit from that scene. And if you think that Paul Newman was fantastic with the deck of cards, that is not so, because uh, the hands belong to a magician called John Scarney, and he did all the card mechanics uh, in this movie. Anyway, uh, only th this brief moment influenced me so much that I wanted to do this. My purpose with this is actually, uh, I'm going to try to reenact everything uh, that John Scarney did. Uh, well, <laughs> Paul Newman if you like to. Uh, well, look at this. strange though because uh, if you are nine years old at the time when the movie came out and I was maybe 16, 17, 18, something like that when I, when I really saw this uh, movie the first time um, and it influenced me so much. I was sitting in my home in the northern part of Sweden uh, with the cards and, and dealing the cards and kept on doing that and uh, well now since I was 20 years old it has been my profession. So I am a professional magician nowadays uh, but I seldom do. I never cheat in a card game just so you know. But it was a great movie. Uh, I think well it won seven Oscars in 1973 so it must be good and uh, well, maybe I should now just go and watch it and see 
if it still holds up. Take care.